So, oh my gosh, it has been a while. There's a lot going on, and I will fill you guys in in time. It's nothing weight related or anything. It's just life. It's crazy right now. Um, so I have not been as active on YouTube. That's okay. Uh, I have this past week. I think I talked to you guys. Um, my daughter's birthday party was last weekend. My sister is here. It seems so strange that she was just here because I miss her so bad. Um, but she was, and it was just crazy. Um, 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 lots of um. So this week I ate maintenance calories um, all week. I did work out. It was a four workouts week. Um, two of them wound up on the same day, but there were two different definite sets of workouts. So there you go. Um, God dang. So <laughs> I weighed in. I'm up. 0.6. So, as far as I'm concerned, maintenance calories worked just fine and I maintained. There you go. But something exciting happened today in Weight Watchers. My 66th week weighing in, in a freaking row. Have not skipped a week. Sick, right? Sick. So, I go in and I weigh in and I'm 136.6, fun, so it's like, I don't know, the second week in a row that I've been 136 something since I was like 8 years old, so that's just fun, um, but this makes my 6th week of maintenance, so I got a little bit of key, that's my lifetime key. I get to go to meetings for free. So, on my keychain, which you get for your 10%, and it looks like a 1 and a 0, 10%. Um, or maybe I need to face that to you guys. A 1 and a 0. And it's got Weight Watchers right here. Hit, hold on. Lear! Anyway. It's got, um, it's got, it says Weight Watchers right there, and on the back, it's got your, like, it says 10 in a little oval, and then it's got your star that you get when you get to gold, and then it's got your key that you get when you get to lifetime, right? So, let's go. Ready? Got my 10%, and then on it, I have my 16 week clapping hands. My 25 pounds lost, 50, 75, 100. Um, my 5K charm, where you at? There you go. My gold star and my lifetime key. Oh, oh, yay! So that's exciting. Um, it's crazy. It's so weird. It's so weird. Like, seriously. So it's been a year in three months, roughly. Yeah, May, June, July, August. Yeah, crazy. It's, it's like, I don't know. All I can say is that you just have to keep doing it, for real. Like, if you don't give yourself days off, and you don't start yourself over, and you don't, like, oh, well, that's okay, I'll just eat, and then go back to it, and then not get back to it, and if you really take yourself seriously, and you just keep moving forward, you'll get there, and it's crazy, and I'm a big football fool, like, I am a football head, right, but there's something, like, whenever we're watching a play happen, and the little guy will, like, get the ball, and he starts running, and it's like, you know, a lot of times receivers are slightly smaller or whatever. And he starts running, and there's like, okay, one guy grabs him, two guys grab him, three guys grab him, and your boy still is going. And then there's a pile of guys, and he's still going. And I'll, I'll say to Amber all the time, I'm like, it's crazy. Did you see his 
feet, like his feet just kept moving. He didn't care that he was sideways and had come off the ground. He just kept moving. And he winded up making like an extra two or three yards despite the fact that guys twice his size were piled on top of him. And that's what this is. It's like maybe you've gotten yourself to where you have two or three bodies worth of weight on your frame and maybe you have yourself to where like you have a lot going against you health wise and and you know spirit wise and everything you're down and you don't feel like doing it but if you just keep moving towards it you'll get there and that's so crazy like to think about it to think that I'm getting there and it is getting there because for my personal goal I'd like to lose another six and a half to eight pounds or nine pounds but it's crazy to be at lifetime and to be at a normal healthy body range that's just so insane my BMI is currently 23.3 that is crazy. And I keep saying that too. It's okay. And I'm sure you guys, most of you know the whole story, but we'll just do it since it's a lifetime video. But I mean, 66 weeks ago, I weighed 255 pounds. And I had been at least 100 pounds overweight for five years. What? So so exciting. I'm so excited like to move forward from this and to not not this is not ever going to be over. I plan on using that little key and weighing in every week. <laughs> but just to move forward to like know what can be accomplished and what harnessing my own power can do to change my life and like what you can do for people outside of yourself it's so insane I just can't wait to watch what unfolds um on another really exciting note and and I'm sticking this at the end so I'm gonna talk about it again I'm sure but on another really exciting note I feel better I have felt good for three days um I have a doctor's appointment this week and another appointment early September, September 2nd, but I'm hoping to get that moved up, but I think that the problem was my neck, like the fainting disease problem, and I think we might be on our way to getting it fixed, because I have had three days where I have had only one slightly rough spot, but I have felt good, and I can move like this. And I don't see stars. No stars. Woo -hoo. Oh yeah, that's so cool. Um, yeah. So that means that if we can fix my head, and it's really as easy as just fixing my neck, I might be able to do the mini try. Oh, 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 oh. And in like the second week of October, there's a Zoomathon. So exciting, and then maybe this is the first week of October. I think it's October 8th. The next week is the breast cancer walk. We're gonna do Zoom, but before, and then we're gonna walk. It's gonna be so great. I can't believe I feel better. I want to take my bike for a ride so bad. Oh, and I earned, so you know, this is where, oh man, this video is all messed up. But officially, I've earned my iPad. Now there are there are things there are problems with that and one is that, you know, iPads cost money, obviously. But another problem is that like since my seventy five pound reward, which was supposed to be, I don't know, some kind of crazy shopping trip, I switched it out for Zumba and then since then, it's been like every time I've had the kind of like a kind of chunky reward coming, I've used it to buy something like Zumba or something because that's what I really want. And so I'm kind of stuck in this place where I really want my iPad, but I really, really want like 
probably a new elliptical or something for home. Because I feel like if I had an elliptical, I wouldn't have to go to the gym. And so eventually, it would pay for itself. But I really want an iPad. And neither one of them are actually plausible. So I have to, like, work on both of them. But that just means that I have time to sit here and worry about which one I actually want. Ugh. I just don't know. <laughs> You will hear more from me this week. There, uh, the giveaway is coming. I do have a little um, partial clip, and I'm going to put that together this weekend. And the giveaway for the Wii game is coming. So you will hear more from me this week. I will be around more. Thank you guys so much for hanging out and for being a part of this lifetime, dude. We're at lifetime. Yay. Yay. And I don't know if you watch her, but the fat girl is crazy. Love her. And um, she... It got in the boat. She's doing some kind of rowing thing, and she was making a team, and she made a team. I think we're going to be in four seat. And I said we, because that's how I feel. So now we're a lifetime, and we're in the boat. 